we will progress. You I feel you. I feel you. Give me something for my blood pressure, either. Yes. Yeah, because you raise my blood pressure, man. <laughs> so let's remove. Have, let's have, remove the black. Some, you have to give me something for my blood pressure, Rasta. Uh, although many people love, I uh, like your station. You have uh, two enemies. Not you as a uh, motor. Yeah, but the station, the station. Yeah. Yeah, the station. The, the, the station yeah. has two enemies. enemies. One of them is wanting it to die because uh, you are uh, is overshadowing them in a way. Then the other one is trying to strangle it because of certain things that come out from here to the air. Blessed love, my viewers and subscribers. Wagwan, open all in good, open all in great. Now, my viewer, we're there again on the Soul Chat TV with another Mutabaruka content. And this one is a video that a lot of people have been requesting. And this one is the video of Mutabaruka interviewing the African High Priest, otherwise known as Hibuhan. Now, my people, this video, I have posted the part one first and it somehow did done prematurely because I didn't want to put the whole program there. But now, um, a lot of people have been requesting that I play the, the rest of the, the tape. So, this is what we're going to be getting into. And I'm telling the people, a whole lot of fire gashing this one. It get really, really heated. If you think the last one was heated, this one is something else, my people. And also, highly educational too. So, my people, definitely stay tuned and check out what Munta Barak have to say. And also, the African high priest. Otherwise, most people would say, the Obia man. But before we get into it, you know, it's a black power movement. So, definitely, drop a like and subscribe. Share to a friend or a family so they can be a part of the movement. Now, my people, the continuation began. Let's go. No. Let's face reality. No, it's me not that. Real, no, here one no. Me face reality long time, you know. Okay. Here my reality now. My okay. reality is this. Yes. That African people was in Africa. Yes. Doing what them doing. You, certain set of mind, a mind is deciding that it is because black people come here. Why we are in light, why we know what we know and understand what we understand. No, no, no. That's not, uh, I am saying to you that yeah. there's a lot of things that we did not know in Africa that because we come here, we know. But I refuse to accept this, this, I don't really want to call it stupidity and ignorance that black people was in the dark. No, no, no. They, they, in yeah. Africa. Yeah. And it's white people come there and show the light because black people existed. They can't show us light. Of years yeah, but if we if we didn't have the dark and we come here, so we not the light. Maybe it's may, maybe light. it's a, a misquote or a misunderstanding. What yeah, I'm really you, you trying to you have to choose your words when yes. you talk to me. You know, what I'm trying to say, what I'm trying to say is this: yeah. there are natural atmospheres but it, conducive it's, it's, for people. Slavery like you are in the studio now. If I take you out thing. under a tree, you cannot uh, perform as you are performing in the studio. Yeah, but what I'm trying to say thing. is, slavery not a natural thing. We came to civilize the white man in many aspects. Civilize this white man in many aspects, so, and we are, so and we are, and we are still doing it. They troop there every day to take knowledge. White people. What I'm saying is, what? What you mean civilize? We can't civilize somebody. Them have them civilization already. Well, what I'm, 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 a, I'm a bush doctor and a native doctor. My English. You should always uh, no, interpret. No, I understand your English, man. I okay. understand your English okay. clearly. It's you what? don't understand my English. I, okay. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe I don't your understand English. your own. Yeah, yeah. What I'm trying to say really is uh, what the black man had done in all parts of the world. Yes. After leaving home, developed those countries. The underworld productions. Yeah, but I don't it, say no to that. You I don't say, say no. no. No, I don't say I, I. I'm not disputing that. Yes, I know that so the, con the saying, contribution of black people mm. to the Western civilization is enormous. Is, 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 you can see it. But to say, to say that white people, the absence of white people in Africa, no, 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 means no, no. Uh, we that would is, be in darkness. That that is not my Man, you have to go what, what, and do some things for, for rectify that. What Muta there. is misinterpreting is that I said. My people leaving home gave them the opportunity to do what they are doing there. In fact, let's face reality. If we were at home, we won't be able to. You think it if is now that home, our people are going days. home, that our people are going home, that we are having conducive atmospheres for 
create uh, no no uh, for manufacture of certain things if we never connect to european civilization we'll be living longer because most indigenous people live long and yes. it's when them start to associate with the western mindset that yes. you see them them all sorts of things that we never know about uh, start uh, to take all of it i agree with you yes so that I is agree what I with you thing. because living longer yeah. would be better because in that civilization food medicine and everything we are taking from them are shortening our lives yes so what I that, agree. that is darkness well, that, well, is dark, well, that is darkness that is not light that is not light yes, yes it's, it's, it, it is. is the light that we have and we had are most most, most indigenous, indigenous cultures, cultures have, have. Yes. yes the, the western, western world, world has wiped out that i feel and has caused the people them i feel yeah, we we progress. You I feel. Me I feel. You have to give me something for my blood pressure, you know. Yes. <laughs> because you raise my blood pressure, man. You so let's remove. Me, let's you remove you the black. Some, you have to give me something for my blood pressure, Rasta. No problem. <laughs> what What is good for blood pressure? Tell me. You know the African tradition, you know, because the Western thing now work. You said uh, what is uh, What is good for blood pressure? Because okay. in this society, okay. this Western society, you we see, are prone to. The you rising know? of our pressure because of talk like what you just talked. Okay. So, so the blood me. pressure will leave. I withdrew the blood, the darkness and the blood pressure will go. Blood pressure yeah. is caused by many things. Yes. One. Like one Africans come and come tell you say we would be the dark. It's the white people. No, we will never. Blood pressure. We, okay. That have the, blood pressure. So yeah. tell me something to heal the blood pressure. Don't tell me what cause it. Okay. You know what cause it. Tell me what to the, the, to the, destabilize it and get rid of it. Okay. Yes. Uh, in Jamaica, there are some leaves. Yes. If you eat them three times a day for a certain number of days, yeah. blood pressure is gone. Tell me the leaf, leaf them. I don't, I don't know the name, but I can show it to you. In Africa, they... It's in this book? Huh? It's in this book? In, the same leaf. If I write it there, I won't eat again, Muta. <laughs> so if I write it there, I won't eat again. How would you come to me? No, but they don't, I will leave an artifact for you can sell, man. Be yourself, man. You so leave an artifact. If you man. want to come to school, you come, I, I train you, you pay me, then when you graduate. No, but now that me I use brethren. <laughs> now that me I use brethren. Me huh? I use friends. Now that me I use developing a relationship. That's here. true. Honestly speaking, yeah. high blood pressure is caused by bad foods and so many things. Mm. Then the worst one of it is those caused by bad people, voodoo and things like that. Mm. But they can all be treated. And the, the first treatment is uh, you must uh, tell yourself that uh, you will obey the laws of nature. Mm. You must rest. You must not uh, over-exercise yourself with women and things like that. Mm -hmm. Then number two, there are certain foods that uh, relaxes uh, your blood uh, pressure. Mm -hmm. Then there are certain animals. I don't know if you have heard of snail. Yeah, we have no snail, man. Uh -huh. yeah, man we have no the snail. water for, from snail is one of the best curatives for high blood pressure. Mm -hmm. Then uh, there are some leaves, vegetables, mm -hmm. which you eat, and then they... Uh, maybe if... Uh, I think I have uh, a few in uh, Mobe, mm -hmm. medication for blood pressure and uh, diabetes. All right. So you, and, you, you, um, you have a, a office where you, you accept patients. In Mobe? No, no. in, in where, wherever you live. In yeah, Africa. I have a herbal hospital in Nigeria. Then I have a... You have a hospital in Nigeria? Yeah. yeah. I mean, uh, like a herb hospital. A herbal hospital. You don't deal with... Um, the, no, the, no, no, the, not with uh, modern medicine. Medi medical, it's, it's modern herb. medicine. It's herbs. Just pure herbs. Yes. yes. Then uh, in the uh, U.S., I have uh, some Americans who studied under me, not uh, black Americans. Uh, where they initiated and they are healing. So I prepare medications for them and they use them to treat their patients. In, 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 in Florida? In, in U.S. We're we in U.S., in Florida. One is in uh, Oakland, California, Nedra Williams. He has a You're Chicago. serious? Me come out Oakland all the while, you know? It's the ad her address is in that book, too. Uh, yeah? Yes. Oh, I forgot to tell my friend, must check your man. Uh, I have some bridging where would would come and talk to you. Uh, yeah, that's in Oakland. Okay. Yeah, they have... um. Vegetarian restaurant in Oakland. Okay. Yeah. Then uh, in Miami, I have uh, a harbor hospital in the air. What do you mean? Uh, that means 
uh, the permanent place is not ready. Okay. So, uh, although the medications are in our house, yes. but I move here and there to treat the patients. So, where, where are these artifacts that you speak of? Where, oh, where are the artifacts? About 300 and something uh, pieces were loaned to Broward County Library mm. 12 years ago. They are preparing to return them to Africa now. Oh, yeah. Because uh, I want them to return them. Then, we have some in our house for emergency exhibitions. Okay. Like some people want to do like, uh, what do they call those uh, police uh, in America? They were doing uh, 30 years or uh, 25 years or 50 years. They came to loan some of them. Mm -hmm. Then uh, in my website, you will see quite a lot mm -hmm. uh, in there. Yeah. One thing is I don't sell the antiquities. Yes. Although I've never sold one yet, yeah. but I think by the time we open the center, there will be a craft shop. Mm. Uh -huh. Well, because uh, we want them, like other tribes, yes. to be penetrating the world. Yes. Okay. Yeah. This is the cutting edge, and I refrain. We're talking to the chief Eberhon here, and things and things, you know. We see our CD, a DVD here, is about um, a theater troupe. What is this theater troupe? What, uh, the, theater, how? the theater troupe. Yes, I born international theater yeah, troupe. Yeah. What happened is the way the white man dealt with my kingdom mm -hmm. was what made me leave uh, Christianity and then uh, I started uh, uh, traditional worship. That DVD is on the sack of Great Benin by Britain. Mm. and the deportation of our Oba in 1897. Mm. In fact, the Oba of the kingdom gave me beads. Immediately it came out uh, some months ago. It took me 14 years to, to work on, mm. and I came to Negri, Jamaica, to take sunset. Mm. Jam uh, Negri, Jamaica is there as one of the locations. Oh, so this is not your first visit here? Uh, my my third or fourth visit. Oh, this is the third or fourth In 1977, visit. I was here as a government artist. I led 61 artists to oh, come yeah. and thank Jamaica for participating in the first act. The minister, yes, the yes, late yes, Chief yes, Enao yes. came, Dr. Siwaju came, and some other officials of the mm -hmm. National Theatre. Mm -hmm. But I was the head of the artists. All right, explain to me your, 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 um, your regalas that you have. Explain to me. Well, this is, uh, I'm dressing like a traditional Bini and a high priest. Yes. The red on top is to show you that I'm a high priest. And this is to Aramila. This is to Ogun Olokun. And this is to Ogun, the god of iron. Whereas these are uh, for Chief Tensi and being a, a Bini man that has been honored. So what kind of bead is that? What kind, what These kind? are the real coral beads. Cor okay. It's not the fake one. So if you look at them, the yeah. whole I'm putting on the body now, if you put it on scale, it will weigh more than uh, uh, two, uh, almost uh, 50 pounds. Uh, it will be more than 50 pounds. Yeah. They are very heavy. Yeah. Those beads. Yeah. All right. And, they, and they, the, the same beads on your hand is the same beads. Yeah, the round one. Yes. Can only be worn with the permission of the Oba of Bene. Okay. You cannot. It's forbidden. And as it's on my neck, I cannot put anything in my mouth. If I want to, I must remove them. Oh, yeah? Yes, it's forbidden. Why, why is that? It's forbidden. Well, tell me why. The ancestors will be annoyed. It's a disrespect and dishonor mm -hmm. to them. Mm -hmm. mm. He said, those who know the king never fell in Roko tree. Okay. Mm. Okay, that's very interesting. And that um this one that's ivory. The uh government of America issued a paper on it yeah. to what? say that I did not violate the American law by, by bringing it to the country is part of my regalia. Yeah. So they I've been traveling with it to America since 1977. But Three years ago, some uh, young uh, immigration or custom boys were very agile and uh, mm. enthusiastic, and then they took it. They said uh, it's uh, ivory. So yeah. I told them that they will return it. Mm. So after one month, they wrote me a letter 
I had a letter in the hotel in Mobe mm. that uh, it was detained at Detroit Airport. Mm. But uh, after uh, going through it, they found that I did not violate the American law mm. or the law of America by doing, and uh, it had been returned. I should sign. Mm. The, I signed. So it's one of my the paraphernalias of my yeah, office. Right. Explain to me why. All right, Go, going back again to your Uber because. I am kind of getting this feeling yeah. that you are very nationalistic when it comes on to Benin. Mm. Like, everything, I, I, am, I am figuring that everything is centered to you in Benin and Bendel State mm. in, in terms of the traditions of life and the gods and everything. But they, 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 there is a feeling that the Africans, including the Nigerians, who find themselves in Nigeria, came mm. from Northeast Africa, mm. which is like in Egypt, Kemet, mm -hmm. Ethiopia, and these places. I, I realize that you don't give credence to that. You don't accept that. I will reality. not, because most... For instance, the Yoruba culture germinates from Benin, but because they went to school before us, they were trying to uh, to pervert history. Mm -hmm. The Oba of Benin wrote a book, Yours Faithfully, I Am, Yours Faithfully, where he explained the Benin Ife relationship, which you will find in that in book, book too. Yes. Uh, what happens is that uh, the last of the Ogisos, Kings of Benin before the Oba ship started was uh, banished for ordering the execution of a pregnant woman. Mm. But before then, he made he asked that his son should be executed on the basis that uh, the chiefs and his wife said uh, it was the boy that made him not to have uh, more children. Mm -hmm. But fortunately for the boy, they did not kill him. They asked him because they were not sure he would have any other child. Yeah. So it was he that founded Ife. And if you get go there, Ife is a mini word. I, I Ife. I Ife. I have escaped to, uh, to safety it's in that book. Mm -hmm. And the first son, I chose the road to posterity. Everything is there. Mm -hmm. So when in 1971, Professor Biobaku a very top Yoruba scholar was, and uh, Abiola Irele were asked to defend certain clauses in Ola Rotimi's book of Onram and Nogbaisi. They could not. And I told them, if I ask you 19 questions on the areas you are authority and you are able to answer two or three, I will allow the, the phrases to go. They were not. And so they were expunged. Yes. From the pool, because I know you are looking at time. That's why I'm also... No, and that time I'm looking at is, is, is okay. advertisement. Yeah. No, is it? So, so, you believe that life started in Benin? Uh, definitely. We, even in Benin, we say Edo is Yagmo. Yeah. Benin is the origin of the world. What happens is that anywhere you go on earth, you must find one thing or another in Benin that is there. For instance, in Japan, half of their vocabulary are Benin language. Mm. In Japan. Mm. Japan, Tokyo is Edo. The meaning of Japan is Edo, which is the language we speak, and so on and so forth. If you go to uh, Boston, Massachusetts in America, you will find Ivie, you will find uh, Ogbewi, you will find uh, Erie. Mm. They are Benin words. I, 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 and then the soil in Benin, the red Dulakpa, the red soil in Benin. Mm -hmm. Only China has something that is very near resemblance, but it's not as authentic as that of Benin because the one of Benin is uh, gummy. That is what we use in uh, preparing the bronze work. Ulakpa no geken. Ulakpa, the king of uh, soil. Mm -hmm. Yes. All right. We. I, I have been among some what I'm called Native Americans in. Um, uh, Phoenix, Arizona, in yeah. Arizona. Yeah. Named the Opie mm. Indian. I don't know if you ever hear of them. Mm. This is a group, very, very passive kind of people, very spiritual. Yeah. 
they carry me to a stone and this stone is said that if this stone move the earth that's it they believe that at certain points in the where Arizona that is where the earth started that is where people started or oh, 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 you see that I mean I know you don't accept that but yeah. what, what I'm trying to say is that it would appear to me that in every tradition people get so close up with their section of earth that they yeah. believe that they are all like that they are only yet the best still, yet mm. still there is no archaeological evidence yeah. the, to prove mm. that this is where it started there are all right yeah for instance right. let me tell you there are many laws in nature mm -hmm. for instance you know the rooster or the cock the cock yes Kakaraka, until it kills a snake it does not crow it's a law of nature mm. Until an eagle kills a, a tortoise or a turtle, it cannot that grow. include worm, huh? That include worm, eagle. No, the cock. No, not worm, snake. But there's no snake in Jamaica. And then and cock crow. There, there are snakes in Jamaica. No, there's no snake. Look. That, uh, right. Well, you see, I, uh, I, I, you. I, I won't argue with you yet. Because I'm not going to argue with you about the cock in, a, in a Nigeria. Right now. But I, I, won't argue, I won't argue, argue with you. About the cock in a Jamaica. I won't argue with you. Cocks crow in Jamaica and them don't eat snakes. You will be shocked that you have snakes in Jamaica. No, listen. I'm not saying that snake that's in Jamaica. I'm saying that okay. cocks crow in Jamaica are, that has never seen snake. You are, uh, that's true. You are yeah. exaggerating some scientific assumptions. No, you are. That's, that snakes something. are not in Jamaica. You will be shocked. No, you are. No, no, I'm not saying. The that's next no, time no, I will come. No, no, the no. next time I will come. I will. I will. Snake. I will take you out. No, I never said. You snake take that a tape Jamaica. recorder. Then I will. I will call a snake from your bush. If no, it comes, it means I brought it snake. from Africa. Look here, I'm not saying that. I, I have seen snake in Jamaica. You have not seen it. Even few have, days. Few here. days before I came. Now. No, man. Listen to me, Bridget. Few days before I came from uh, US. Now. I was going on foot because every morning I trekked three miles. I saw a lizard cut off the head of a small snake. But so I quickly called now. fire brigade. Uh, uh, yeah, hear me now. I called fire brigade. Yeah. I called the owner of the house. I said, look. So he said he didn't know there, is, there are snakes around his house. But I am what? telling you that I know such snake is in Jamaica. Yeah. I have seen snake. I know people who keep snake. Oh. Okay. And feed them with rat. Yes. And keep feed them with egg. But you've never seen a snake. Yes. Okay. I have seen a snake. Okay. I have seen snake all the while in Jamaica. Okay. What I am saying to you, that cocks crow here. Crow here without eating snake. You are right. Let me tell you one thing. There are two differences between the cock that crows after killing a snake and the cock that crows uh, what we call a uh, uh, artificial crowing do you know cocks that are the cocks that are bred inside their cages they crow you know that but i thought about cock the one that kills a snake will tell you when you are entering the road don't go there is danger no, I don't say no to that, you know. I just have say to make this broad statement that cocks crow only when they eat snake. Is yeah, that I agree with you, but okay. I'm telling you that there are two categories yeah, of uh, cock. the cock that is in the cage crows yes. without killing a cock. The cock in Jama in, uh, not without killing a snail. A snake, I mean. Yeah, yeah. Snake. Yeah. Uh -huh. the, the one in Jamaica crows without killing a snake because you haven't seen a snake here. But no, if this I see snake here, but them don't eat, kill the snake for eat for crow. Oh, you saw snakes, but the cocks don't kill them. No, I no no. Okay, right, well, let, me go slow. let me go slow. Let me go slow. Okay, there's a language thing happening here. Okay, in Jamaica, yeah, there are many snakes in Jamaica. Snakes, yes. Okay, there are snakes in Jamaica. Okay, I am coming off what you said. You said that cocks crow because they eat snakes. And I, I am know. saying to you that in Jamaica, yeah. cocks crow without killing snakes. But no, you are now rebutting it now and saying no, the cocks that crow is but false I will, crow. I will also hold you to that because a cock will not say, Mr. Muta, come and say, I want to kill a snake so that I can crow. 
Lord. They don't do that. They kill them. But you still admit, you still, you still insist that they cut them in a drum. A, a, a cock in your compound can kill the snake without your seeing it. Brethren. Very, tell, tell very about, authentic. No, tell me about the cock in Nigeria. Don't tell me about the Jamaican cock. Well, I agree with you. The Jamaican because cock with all bark. <laughs> the no, ones no, in Nigeria, no, when they are no, killing snakes, they don't kill the, they don't call the landlord. They, call, they don't call the king and say, come, yeah. I want to ki yeah. kill a snake so that I can crow. Yeah. It is natural to them that they kill a snake. Yeah, to crow, when, they, they could crow. be killing it under your bed without yeah. your seeing it. Yeah. So that well, is the thing. They kill them in the bush. We don't go with we don't nomad with the with the with the cocks yeah, yeah. when they are going inside the bushes nomadically and they snake a snake can kill it we won't know yeah, yeah. except if the one that uh, kills his his own is coming with you dragging it like then you say this one has killed the snake mm -hmm. maybe one day you will see it so that they can prove me right but you, you see you still in a insist that Jamaican Jamaican cock crow. It's because them eat snake, and I tell you, say no, no go so. I agree with you, but what I'm saying is, yeah. the cock cannot invite you from the studio to no, come I and see it killing them. I know that. Okay, I okay, know that's that. okay. Then number I, I two, that. Yeah. number two, I told you there are cocks or like, roosters in cages, in cages. So they have a uh, false crowing. The false yeah, growing. Yeah. That's what you say. But the that. ones that have the authentic natural the ones who kill the snake. They tell you when 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 they crow at certain times, they tell you what is going to happen. All right. And then they, they say go and kill that cock. It's like when you see a dog dig a a, a ground and put his head into it. Yeah. In Jamaica you say it doesn't mean anything. It's not your fault because time has uh, changed certain things. But when the repercussion comes, they don't know it is because of that. All right, tell me why the dog, come my dog do it all the way. So tell me why the when dog. When he does it all the time, he doesn't do it when something is not going to happen. Mm. When he digs a hole and puts his head inside, yes. it means somebody is going to die. Yes. But you can prevent that accidental death if you kill the dog. If you kill it. As, uh, the, right. uh, I have a neighbor in a, 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 in a place. I don't want to mention the place. They are Cubans. Yeah. The wife was kissing the dog. I said, did you inject this of rabies? And he said, medical doctor. Then uh, she said, yes, we have done it. Mm. So right. many I things. Ask you a question. Uh -huh. Have you ever known a case where a person, the dog digging the hole, and the, the person dead, a person dead. Have I ever? Or you, you know of cases yeah. that the dog digging the hole yeah. simply shows you that the per, somebody's going to dead. So okay. the person dead. I've seen a lot. All right. Have you ever seen a case where you kill the dog and somebody's still dead? You could be right, but I have never seen so one. You've never seen that yet. Because I know when they do it, there will be a sign that something like this wanted to happen. Yeah. But it didn't happen again. Yeah. But where they kill the dog and the, the man still dies, it could be possible, but I will be Mr. No All if I say I saw it. Yes. It's the good ones I will see. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. So that is, as, that is from the Benin tradition. Not Benin tradition, that is African tradition. It's an African tradition that yeah. if a dog keeps digging a hole, and laying down in the hole. In the what? In the hole. In Wood? Hole. Hole. In the hole. He it digs, it digs out a dirt. And yes, yes. And put his head inside. Yes. It, it, that it's, means somebody is going bad omen. It's not good. And if you kill the dog, it means uh, the woman pass. Yes. Something bad is going to happen in that, in that house. Yes. Or in that family. So they quickly kill it. Yeah. All right. I have seen... Well... Uh, you know, I don't know nobody where from from I see dog I do this thing. Yes. Maybe them dead far away. But I don't know of nobody were dead. You know, yeah. my life because I never kill the dog. Because I personally know say anybody were dead around me is is something 
that is happening to them. Yeah. But I don't. I, I am. I am very conscious. It's not the we dog. Are, no, we are, no, no. Listen, I am very conscious. Yeah. That dogs know things. For instance, earthquake. Yeah. I know that dogs ear have a ear for things that human beings don't have and mm. a perception. Yeah. So I am I, not crossing off what yeah. you're saying. You know. I am I, not crossing off what yeah. you're saying. You know. Let me quickly chip in this one. Yeah. I don't know if Jamaican dogs do it. If you want to test food, if it has been poisoned, give the dog. Give dog. And if the dog okay, but uh, these are Asian dogs, they eat it and die. You know what the Europeans used to do? That, uh -huh. The Europeans used to give them servant it. <laughs> so servant they even some some they eat it. some young thieves in my country will poison chicken and give to a big man's dog. He will eat it and die of the poison and take his car away. But the traditional dogs, they won't eat. Hmm. The same thing with lizards. I don't know the lizards. If you throw food on the ground and it, it doesn't eat, it means the food is bad. All, all right. In Jamaica, they say that if a goat eat a, a plant, a goat, it, it never grow. Yeah, it never grow again. Mm. And I proved that that not that is not true. You see, I, you know what? You know, wait, wait, Sika. You know what I prove? Mm -hmm. I prove that the reason why the goat. When the goat eat the thing, it don't grow again. Because the goat eat it to the point where we root it out. Because I know plants. I see plants where goat eat continuously. And every time I go back there, yes. the plant flourish. So when I look at the plant them that don't grow back, is the one where the goat eat and shake him head. So every time he hold the leaf, he shake him head and root out the plant. Yeah. So them say the, the, the plant I eat. So those little things is is observations that I am feeling that a lot of people give it over to some nature of superstition, but it have some relationship with something that can be explained. No, I not giving over where it where you say about the dog. Yes. Not, I, I know that it's not the dog causing the death. Mm. But I know say dogs have a perception. And dog of an ear that is beyond human being. Mm. So I, I wouldn't, you know, a dog. I agree the dog's uh, no. intelligence, no. but no. why the, uh, the average African mm. believes in his intelligence? Mm. That is why they know that if he yeah, yeah, sees poison, he'll be able to. to why? Yeah. Although we have ones that are superior to the dogs or you cut it on your finger mm. if you are going to carry the food it will be mm. uh, you put ant in the medic in the herb mm -hmm. in the voodoo you use herb to grind it mm -hmm. uh, uh, ant to grab it so if you are taking it and it stinks you then you know there is poison in the food yes yes, yes. we have the, the one for dictating uh sexual diseases yeah. you cut it seven around the waist when you are then uh, you are unable the to Japan, the, the Chinese have chopstick that yeah. they take poisoning food. Uh -huh. You know, chopsticks yes. that they eat with. They have certain chopsticks that they make that when you put it in the food, they will they know take, it is poison. They, they take poison. Oh. All right. The, in the Benin, how oh, 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 you view polygamy? If what? Polygamy. 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 Okay. How oh, 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 do Benin? I know, Benin. I know. Yeah. Well, uh, not only Benin, all Africans. Yeah. And uh, even in Jamaica and Europe and America, yeah. they practice it more, but in a very uh, clever and uh, trickish way. Yes. I hardly, but that is not polygamy. That is girlfriend and boyfriend and sweetheart. What is that? That is cheating. That is sweetheart. We are talking about polygamy in terms of a man have more than one wife. And that is what and I'm telling you. Yeah, but in Jamaica, a man do have more than one wife, you know. Him have him wife and him have a girlfriend. Him have a girl, him have a sweetheart. So that is not wife. Yeah. That is concubine. So I talk about now Let me tell the you, legitimacy of polygamy in Benin. You know... The white man or the white person, uh, our people call him Abel. Yeah. Then a reverend father is also Abel. So they saw a white man, a reverend father coming. They say, look at Abel. He said, no, it's not, a rev it's not Abel, it's a reverend father. What is the difference? You have a, a concubine or a girlfriend outside. I have two wives in the house. Tell me the difference. The difference, mm. the difference is that 
The you are a, I, I can tell you the difference. The difference is that you are a thief and dishonest person. No, no. And then I'm a... Yeah, and the difference is that the, uh -huh. the, the, the two people them in the house... Yes. ...agree in the house with you. Yes. In the sweetheart thing is a dodge. Yes. The sweetheart dodge <laughs> and the, the wife feels uh, her husband do have not more somebody but she. So, as well you said, deceit. So, what may I say to you now? In yeah. the Benin, do they have a polygamous relationship that is legitimate? Yes, like in Jamaica and other places. No, they don't have polygamy in Jamaica. They have. In Benin? Huh? No, wait. I, let me tell you, in Benin, mm. I may have one wife in the house, in my house, yeah. and build house for the other one outside. But the other one, no, it's, don't We it. still call them polygamists. But in uh, America or Europe or in Jamaica, you say that's a mistress, that's Sweetheart. a this, that's yeah, a yeah, this. But yeah. it's, uh, it's the and same. And the other one know that you build the house for the other one. The one in the house? The one in the house know that you build the house for the next one. Oh, yes. That, that we are saying, but when we build house for the next one, the one in the house don't know. That is why I call you a thief. Yeah, they're not, they're and they dishonest that's person. That's why I'm asking you. Uh -huh. oh, that's why I know. That's why I'm asking you. If in Benin, we, we are we are we are number one in it. Ah, that's my, one of my kings married about eight hundred wives. Yeah. Well, I met a man who had my my gate man has three wives. I met a man in Cameroon uh, with seventy two because wives. I'm educated mm. and a refined native doctor that uh, I don't want to practice it. Don't want to practice what uh, polygamy. I will do it the way you do it here. Sneak. I, I, I will be hiding or stealing hiding. to go oh, there. Okay. Yes. Okay. So I practice the Jamaica type. No, you're not Jamaica type. I'm not Jamaica type. I'm not Jamaica. I'm not Jamaican. My I'm brother, it's not Jamaican. call a spade a spade. Once you have an extra woman outside, you are a polygamist. Right. That is the yeah, definition. Yeah, that is the yeah. definition. No, we are okay. Not brethren. Okay. I understand what you're saying. Like, okay. You not understanding what I am saying. Yes. I just want to know. You see, when I go to Israel, when I go to certain part, the Muslims, in the Muslim tradition, the wives gather together, eat together. Look after the children together in we, Muslim tradition. We do it in Benin. That's what I'm asking. I said because, yes. Because in Jamaica, we don't do it that way. That is in what... In Jamaica, we hide. We hide and do it. Okay. So when I build a house to my, my other wife, and I we, don't make that wife know that my wife, I build a house to that wife and I buy a car for that wife out there. And my wife in my house will feel like she's the only wife. No, I know uh, what you say. No, that in Benin, but she knows. It's only, it's only, yeah, it's only. Instinctively. The woman in the house knows. It's only fooling the husband. Yeah, it's only leave this idiot to be yeah. playing himself about. So, so you, they, you, they you, all come to me everywhere in the world. So you practice polygamy, like yes, sir. The Muslim, yes, sir. Polygamy. Yes, sir. Like yes, sir. Like yes, sir. The Muslim, yes, sir. Because I know the Muslims. <laughs> how the Muslims work it. And it only the Beninese and the Muslims, the Americans, the British, the Jamaicans, they don't. And uh, if I were keeping record, you will find that the polygamists in Jamaica are more than the ones in there. Uh, so I'm telling your wives now to be very, very vigilant. Well, man is by nature polygamous. They should be very vigilant and no. tell you, go and bring her home or you leave her. No, my... I think uh, the laws of this country should be revisited. Yeah. So that, well, I uh, think so too. I yes, they, so, too. so that uh, they forbid you going out to have uh, a secret wife. Okay. If you are married, just marry her and bring her home. That is what I'm will make about. you. It will make you the right son of your ancestors. All right, so you answer the question then. Okay, you yes, we are. All right. What we about, are polygamists. All right, what about um, female circumcision? Circumcision. Female circumcision. Yeah. The the most foolish thing that the House of uh, Assembly in my in my state in my country has done was to be making a law against female circumcision. It's stupidity. Although nobody right, tell me nobody this. nobody uh, obeyed it. Let me tell you the values of uh, circumcision. Female circumcision. Yeah, female circumcision. Yeah. You see, in the West, and uh, maybe do they do in Jamaica? No. And uh, then they are they are women will be like that. A lot of them, not all of them, are so promiscuous because their clitoris overgrow. And they, you know they are naturally sexually sensitive. When they are at, 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 at a lot, 
they make the body to be shaken and the woman can commit adultery anywhere or prostitute anywhere. Mm. It accounts for I'm sorry, ladies, I didn't I don't mean to be to be rude. No, we just being a, 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 a yes. real show when it's African. That's Once how it is. Yeah. that clitoris is not caught. There are some uh, uh, tribes in my country, they don't circumcise their girls until they are ready to have their first issue. Yeah. But in our own case, on the seventh day, we circumcise them, except if the child is sick. Yeah. And then they wait until the baby is well. Yeah. They could delay it to one year, two years, ten years, or, or so. So what do they do with the child, the male child? It's automatic. It must circumcise. No, I mean, f f to prevent that promiscuity that you speak about. Because they, what they, you said a while ago is because of promiscuity. Yes, I that, they, you, that they circumcise There are them. more they promiscuous may, males than females. In the West, you mean? In Africa. The males in Africa are circumcised? No, no, no. Not circumcision, no. Okay. Because we know circumcision is practice. Yeah. I'm talking about for not wanting promiscuity to be in the male population. What do they do with the male population in order to prevent promiscuous behavior by the male. That is why they are also circumcised. And no, two, circumcision and two, don't stop you from being promiscuous. That one? No. So male circumcision does not stop promiscuous behavior. It does. And two, if a man... Not in Africa. If a male is not circumcised, yeah. like you see in some parts of uh, the world, yeah. it looks ugly in that part of the region. You know, what you call ugly? Huh? What you call ugly? <laughs> no, explain. What you call Muta, ugly? You, it's ugly no, because the ugly? the cloth covering it yeah. is there arbitrarily and it has no 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 no, no beauty decency. That's beauty. number one. But nobody now hold it up in front and say, "Oh, this beauty." It's not like that. I as it conti meal. as it continues to grow, yeah. as the body continues to grow, yeah. the teeth continues to grow and then is dropping too. Maybe you are. Uh, it's only your own. You know. You don't know others own. No. We no, we had the opportunity. No, no. no. What I am asking. What yes. I am asking. Yes. I talk about if the beauty in the penis and everything. What I'm saying to you yes. is this: that a circumcision of mm. the male does not prevent promiscuity. Firstly, it it, it prevents. But one thing you must oh, also it know is that uh, yeah. One thing you must also know that you see every pocket of mankind yeah. have been given laws by nature to follow. Yeah. And one of you, I was, I, I, was reading, I was reading uh, a book today uh, and that So nature don't Jamaica. know what they're doing when they make you with, yes. with penis. What, with, with, with the men, tip, penis when tip. you circumcise them, mm. you make them not to be cosmic, uh, promiscuous too because but I, one, that is not true. That is not true. Okay. Because African man, African man, sexuality is promiscuity. No, we're talking about the, the reasons for the male, the female circumcision, according to you. The first is one is not promiscuity. The, the, the first one is in obedience to natural law. Man and woman should be circumcised. Why? Because in Africa, there are some that means that there are hmm? that forbid those people from entering their shrines and courts. Yeah, that is uh, in, in, a, in most tradition. In the EU okay. tradition, it is like then, that too. But I am saying to you, my yeah. brethren, mm. we're talking about the reason for female circumcision. And you gave the reason as uh, the, the, the most important thing for female is you built in. Belief is one thing. That is religion. Yeah. There are some tribes when they do not circumcise their children and the clitoris overgrown. They use rope to tie it like this. If it touches the baby's head, the baby will not live. But you know, it's man, it's man doing these things to women. Man doing it to women. It's man creating these things. The promiscuity of women. Yeah. And the need to prevent this from all of the female quality. And now he's saying that he's going to invent something to prevent promiscuity amongst women. But him though have nothing... And wait, you can't, you can't have him balls. Maybe you should have cut off him balls then. Cut well, off it, his, his penis. Because I trust my brethren, mm. circumcision no prevent promiscuity. Mm. Trust me, Panda one. Day. So a woman that wants to flirt with flirt without uh, 
with uh, circumcision is what you are saying no no what i am saying is that is man that is deciding these things oh, that they should be some promise to you and i am saying no if that is the case for male for it's, female promise queen, it's not the only that is an evil yeah. thing against women to me that's an evil there action are, against women there are three major reasons yes one yes is that naturally there are some children if their hairs touch clitoris they will not leave yeah. then two the woman's body that is not the woman that is not circumcised yes. the body will grow to such a place it become it brings an ugliness to her what then ugly, number what three ugliness when huh? you say ugliness what you mean don't you so see, I, so I don't want yourself. to use uh, obscene words no don't use obscene words just say vagina you, you can't no, say no not vagina. vagina the clitoris yeah. we, there, have you ever seen a clitoris yes, that is as yes, long yes. as four inches if I've had, well four inches yes i've never measured it yet but i am uh, would me, that would that be a thing of beauty to that lady but it's not every woman that don't circumcise out well, that well whatever in the your case, tribe in, yes in, in benin not only benin anyway yeah, in yeah. certain parts of africa yeah women clitoris might grow to four inches where you have to cut it but i am saying to you yeah. that this is a tradition that is saying promiscuity. Yeah, sorry, dear. Let me ask you a question. When did the Jamaicans start to uh, circumcise their girls? I don't know if women, a man circumc circumcising girls in Jamaica. Yeah, because you see, we are going, we, are, draw, we, are, drawing, we are drawing the hands of the clock back. You inherited that from. No, man, we're not when you left, you, when, you, from no, where you man, left home. No, man. You yes. will inherit. You will inherit. You will inherit. <laughs> you will inherit. Uh, we inherit a male chauvinistic idea against women that say, in order for the woman don't, don't go out there and have an next man, you're going to cut her to prevent that. Yet still, me know, without a doubt, that male... The male is more promiscuous. Where a woman will stay with her husband loyally, the chances of a man staying with his, his wife loyally Ms. is less. Mota, let me tell you one thing. You are propagating assumes from maybe some books you have read. No, let me tell you no, authoritatively, no, no, book, book. a woman that is uh, not circumcised. A, a circumcised woman, if the husband is in prison for 10 years, he may be able to wait for many years. Yeah. A sec an uncircumcised woman cannot. Uh, so what to the man? You have what a, pro the you have a program on the, on the radio. What to the circumcised man? Start a research on a circumcised girl and an uncircumcised woman. I don't have no circumcision taking yeah. place in Jamaica, but not what to the circumcised man? Not those hungry authors. Look at man, the circumcised yeah. man? Yeah. When him can't get a woman, him go for your next man. <laughs> in a Jamaica prison. Well, in a Jamaica prison. Look, the, the circumcised man. When him can't get a woman, that is that is him not. Him go for your next man. What of women going with women? No, we not. No, you want no. We not talk about women going with women. No, no what I'm say, trying to say. What is, I am trying to say is yeah. that circumcision of the male yeah. does not say that. He will be less promiscuous. promiscuous. Well, that is what I am saying. Uh, well, naturally, and to cut off a woman, yeah, clitoris, to say that it's going to look ugly. I mean, so you have to say nature no know where did that do. Nature, I mean, nature no know where did that do. When you see the lie, the, the, the laws, you know, laws. Maybe in a bending, the woman them have some five inch clitoris. Are you not like? No, 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 not there because we circumcise all our girls. I look there. You see, all of them is circumcised. We circumcise all of them. Let me tell you one thing. The Laos wow. says you resemble the land in where you stay. Yeah. That is what I think yeah. is uh, happening to uh, yeah. uh, uh, circumcision or no circumcision in Europe, America, Jamaica, mm -hmm. this and that. In Africa, it is a natural law that we should circumcise our children. No, I not say no. I not say no. It's not a natural law. It's, it's a law that was made by men. Okay. It's men make that law. That's okay. It's yeah. uh, I I won't I won't uh, 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 disagree with you that it's yeah. men that made it. Yeah, but man, I know men that make the law. Like some holy books on earth, yeah. we are written 
by, by men that were in one form, in one uh, situation or the other. Maybe those African laws were also made to correct or put in line certain things we think will conform. Like what? Like, like uh, because human beings, we are work with We them. are African traditional worshippers. We have a religion of us. I don't in this time or the time before. Because if it was benefiting Africans in that time, you we see? wouldn't be in the position where we're in right now. You see, uh, you, a lot of those little you, are, you have vindicated me. If we will be dragging the hands of the clock back when I said, if we did not obey natural accord for some of our people of our people to leave home if you were in africa you will advocate that we should uh, uh, you won't say it is men that made that law that women should be the men of africa go say it man i huh? have been to many parts of africa and said the same thing i know what i'm saying is if you were born in africa no i would you say were, yeah because i would be if i was born in china i would have said something else i, I wouldn't be a rasta if i born in india <laughs> i wouldn't be I, I, you know it's just so it goes so i'm saying to you when i look at it on the wider level and yeah. the reason is intelligence we are working with you know yeah is the reason it's not cultural expression we are dealing with now you know yes the reason why you do this is it because of that and when you do it because of that, mm. does it prevent that from happening or it lessen that from happening? I am saying to you, non-apologetically, mm. that the circumcision of men does not stop you from being promiscuous. It, this circumcision of men, or what people say, when you, anyway, when you I, know circumcision, yeah. You're subsected to the disease more than a man who's not circumcised. That is yeah. not true neither. And the circumcision of women for the reason given that you just said. I will prove is to you as chauvinistic at its highest level. Yeah, as a traditional gynecologist of world repute mm -hmm. that have worked with many medical schools on earth. Yes. Harvard is a, a university to be reckoned with. Yes. I have talked to them authoritatively and they have the ones who are destroying the world not on this one any, like anyway Obama. but what i'm telling muta this evening is that mm -hmm. women that are not circumcised are more promiscuous than men that are not circumcised let me put that way and then two men that are circumcised or not as circumcised are not as promiscuous as women that are not circumcised and the beauty of those Garden of Edens are lost if they are not circumcised. Which Garden of Eden you have? Yeah, well, <laughs> no, 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 let us not go into religion. No, well, that God, part of you mentioned it, but you mentioned it. Of Eden, you have that part of the you come from here talk about Garden of Eden. Right? Garden of Eden. Which part of Garden of Eden? Okay, Eden? where is Garden of Eden? Oh, I illusion that a white people illusion. In Louisiana, illusion, illusion. Oh, uh -huh. that is what I'm saying. White because there illusion. was not. What happened was anyway. I don't want to go into religion. Yeah, when I'm it's your right, part of the body. Your part culture. of the body is uh, where the Garden of Eden is. Yeah. That was the apple they yeah. ate. Yeah. So what I'm saying it. Yeah. If the people in the in the Garden of Eden, yeah. which is not there, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's the human body. The man and the woman yeah. were asked not to do certain things until until they were this or that, and they did it. Then their eyes were clear. If you know the day a man starts with a woman is the same cloth that falls from his eyes, uh, then he will be driven out of the garden. All right, well, 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 may I ask you a question? Yes. You, you, you're familiar with the term polyandry? Mm -hmm. You're familiar with that term polyandry? Yes. What do you think about polyandry? What is the type? What do you think about polyandry? Well, uh, it's uh, indiscipline. No, polyandry means. A woman who have more than one husband. That is what I'm saying. I say it's indiscipline. Yes. For a woman to have more than one husband. That is a, 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 I won't call it promiscuity now. It's a type of madness. Yeah, don't, when I, but polygamy is not a type of madness. No, because nature, <laughs> God, God made it that yeah. men should uh, marry more than one woman. Who God make that? God, man made, make, God made no, the law. Man, man make that man. Why, no, 
no, no, no, no. Why, why we say Reggie. God made it is a that... A uh, man make that. Yes, a whether man, man made that. it or God that made it. Nothing to do with that. Why, we, said, that. why we always say that nature made it is... Uh, yeah. You see, the body reacts to, nat to nature's laws. Yeah, man is by nature polygamous. Yes. It has nothing to do with God. Man no. is by nature polygamous. What is by nature? Nature means if you are man, by nature, man, it means nature has commanded you. As a man steer. Adapt me, I say. As nature has commanded you to yeah. do certain. That is why you are by nature this. Yeah. But woman by nature is not made to it's be. It's not polygamous. A polygamist. Yeah. The woman. So when not a woman. Poly, no, not a polygamist woman. in the sense of we are saying it in polyandry. Yeah. All right. So in polyandry. Yes. When a woman take more than one husband in a culture in a culture yes that does not see this as wrong yes you are saying that it is a type of indiscipline indiscipline indiscipline, indiscipline. Yes. Yes. in that culture in that don't, culture, don't, don't, it don't, it don't, don't come that way you know, that, do, you know why? why if, if nature, nature is, anything is anything to go by yes. because many of us or many people do not believe in the existence of god yes so they believe that uh, anything that happens has a reason for happening, but not prompted by any any power or any medium. It's a power man. Power there, power of man there. Yes. Then uh, what I'm saying is when a woman marries more than one husband yes. and put them in the same house, yes. I think I know a couple, a lady that has two husbands yes. in a, a country, yes. which I don't want to mention. I, 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 I asked them, it's not, anyway, it's not Jamaica. Uh, it, I asked why it is so. The, woman, the man said it is so in their culture. Yeah. Then I said, where are you from? He mentioned it then because I hate discussing religion and condemning yes, people's yes, culture. Yes, yes, yes. You see, the pocket of mankind you come from mm -hmm. dictates the thinking of, of your mind. People, true. That's why you call anthropology. Yes. Mean so how you react to the environment what, where you come from. Your yeah. meat could be another man's poison. Yeah, yeah. But what is there is there is an attempted decency to be approached by man. Yes. If you look at it. A universal that, truth you're talking about. You what? You're talking about a universal truth. Exactly. Yes. So there are certain things you should not allow to do. I have so many lesbians as clients and patients. Yes. One of them just phoned me yesterday that he has got a new wife. Yes. A lady. The lesbian. A lesbian. Yes. He said, I've got a new wife from San, yes. San, San Domingo or something like that. Because the former one in Argentina was misbehaving. Uh, I can't tell her you are wrong because uh, they are in the land of the free. Mm. So what I'm saying is there are many things that we ought not to take yes. as right. No, me in understand. Nature. No, I am agreeing with you. You know. Yes. I just so, asking you how oh, you see it, and I'm agreeing with you. I am knowing say, you know. I mean, but what I am saying is yeah. that most of these laws was created by men mm. to keep that feminine energy mm. in place so that man can manipulate it. You see? Because mm. these, these ideas that, that we profess, African, African women, you are saying, you can't no, manipulate Af a, a Afri Jamaican woman or a, an American woman. No, no, no. Listen to me. Yes. No, we, we are saying there's laws that man set in the earth Okay. that is used against women. Mm. Most of the laws, like religion, mm. To me, religion was created by insecure men. Insecure men create religion and say that it's God putting these things inside of them. And then they push it out there like it's a divine energy that is pushing it. And a lot of it is to oppress women. You see, in one of my records, I will I see this, I will send one to one you. Of these? Oh. Not this one. I said, I don't like or not where you give me the part of the party. So the way I said on that party, yes, yeah, I said, uh, I said, because of my neighbors, mm. I'm afraid to say that I do not believe in God because they will say, Oh, our neighbor is already. Mm -hmm. The reason why I said it is that uh, there are so many things happening around us, yes, that ought not to happen, yes, so definitely. The reason why I'm saying it when you are talking of nature, talking of this, talking of that. 
I agree to very limited extent because uh, even the religion you are saying, I agree with you in, t- in total. Religion was only created by man to mellow down our wicked energies. Mm. If you kill a person, you have uh, offended certain people. If you kill but they, they kill they anyhow they today. Is that, is that offense to everybody? They kill uh, anyhow today, but uh, they are, we are not offending anybody. What I'm trying to say is that uh, if you follow the commandments of the Bible, you follow the commandments of the Benis, mm. you will be asking whether the Bible stole from Benin. Like your rated beneath, uh, yeah. because uh, you believe that Benin is the center of the world, that is why you would say that they steal from them. You say what you believe that Benin is the center of everything on so, earth, so on you, earth, yes, on earth. Uh, so you I would, would be a fool to think that, but what I'm saying well, is you uh, be, all right, uh, since be, you're not a fool, yeah. tell me what you believe about Benin because yeah. I am looking through this and I'm listening to you and. You, you are Benin. Yes, I'm a Benin. Yeah. But uh, uh, what I'm trying to say is, uh, for instance, before any law, we didn't know of uh, the Western yeah. commandments until uh, about uh, yeah. 200 or so years ago. Yeah. Before then, we had already known that uh, you should respect your father and your mother. Ah, see, you should who not was, kill. Who, who wasn't in darkness. You should not kill. Yeah. No, th- th- when I say darkness, you are you no, are I'm holding me that. to you no, are no, holding no, me no, to no, it. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> I show me a short story. We don't live in a glass house. We can't show a story. Go and talk, talk, man. <laughs> <laughs> you see, we had him told friend, you know. We had him a big friend, you know. Trust me. <laughs> Yeah, continue, your word. Continue, okay. Continue. So what I'm trying to say really yeah. is, uh, the if you convert any human being or, or an African mm. into any religion he doesn't belong to originally, mm. when he's passing through life with this situation, he returns to that which he knows. Yeah. So what is our original religion? Our original religion is the belief on the things around us. Yes. And talk to them to tr- uh, uh, talk to them to anything we don't understand in nature. White people call it animism. Well, that is to them. Yeah, that's it. White people call yes, it animism. Yes, because they didn't know what to use to condemn a religion that is superior to their own. Yes, yes. So if you go into the lexicon definition of paganism, yes. you will find that pagans are in Europe it's, well, pagans and other places, not in Africa. Yeah. Because yeah. then... Uh, 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 when they came, they said our religion is paganism, which is not. We don't have paganism in Africa. Yeah, but but paganism is a word, you know. But if you look on the the ideas of paganism, yes, you will find it in Africa. Uh, it's also in Europe and Jamaica. No, no, I'm no, but I am saying. Okay, what without, is paganism? Paganism is a kind of nature worship religion. Well, we are there. We see if it's nature worship, we shouldn't have uh, been quarreling with the white man. No, pagan but every in... white man was pagan. Listen yes. to me now. Wait, wait. Stick okay, up yeah. we can call it paganism, you know. But the definition of paganism and what pagans used to yeah. do yeah. is not unique. For instance, locks in Jamaica. Yeah, our people say locks and them say Rasta. Yes, but. Lux is not unique to Rasta. Yeah. There are many people, including Nigeria, as we just spoke of yeah. earlier. Paganism, Pagamos, came from the West when some uh, rude and rascally and robbers in Europe and other parts of the world, apart from Africa, were collected and taken to a place and they were called pagans. But what did the pagans believe? It's in the books they wrote themselves. Right, what did the pagans believe? Pagans yeah. believe yeah. in nothing other than, uh, what would I call it? it uh, they were not religious anyway. No, what did they, they believe? Were, they what were hooligans, they robbers and things like that. No, but that is not true. That it's is true, not my true. dear. No, no, no. Okay, check. I'm talking about what, I'm not talking about, you can't have Christians who are robbers. 
and the Christians were thief. I am saying that there is a belief system in Christianity yes. that is not robbery and that is not thieving. Yes. I am saying to you, I'm, so you're not that you're calling yourself pagan because I don't call myself Christian because I believe a certain way and you can find it in the Bible. Not because I, you can find some of the things that I believe in makes me a Christian. Yeah, in that book I said there is no religion on earth that does not practice sacrifice. Yeah. Every religion. You have blood sacrifice, you have smoke sacrifice, you have uh, as sac human sacrifice is sacrifice. The Israelites used to sacrifice human beings. Even the the the, uh, the Chinese. Yes. They will tie them and the uh, Place them over a shoot, uh, yeah. a, a, a bamboo, a bamboo stick shoot. Yeah, the, the and to go like that. Lions, all of them. Then in uh, Britain, in Britain, they will put human blood in a balloon and fly with it. So what do Benin it. people sacrifice? All those are sacrifices. What do Benin people sacrifice? Uh, before now, before uh, maybe we stopped human sacrifice uh, more than a hundred years ago. So a hundred years ago, you were sac still sacrificing people. Oh yes, of course. Okay. So why you stop? The reason why we stop is um, we started uh, developing. Uh, you you see, we we developed our culture within the. Um, the circumstances involved with our religious belief. Okay, so evolving the, evolving because the in the olden days they were not purely for religion. Okay, the sacrifices were not purely what for was religion. It for? What was it? For? One, it was a punishment. Okay, you mean if like a, a criminal? You sacrifice a criminal. Exactly. Yeah. I, 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 you commit murder, you do this, then they sacrifice, sacrifice him. Okay. Instead of going to hang him or he say sacrifice him to the gods. Have you ever been uh, uh, was it a part of the Benin um sacrifice or sacrifice virgins? First uh, virgins, virgins. Where they sacrifice virgins? Uh, yeah, it was Benin in Benin. Did they like in, in certain in certain um traditions? Yeah. Like in the Hebrew tradition, mm. in the in Mayans, yes, uh, oh, oh, virgin. Yeah, yes, in Benin in the olden days, mm. within the palace system, yeah, they used virgins to were sacrificed or used, yeah, for certain charms. All right. So why did they stop? I said the religion has evolved we, uh, uh, since they were not purely for religion. No, the virgin part matter. It's not probably for virgin. No, it's, it's human sacrifice, whether virgin or... Uh, no, but uh, we're talking about the virgin. Yeah. The female virgin. Yes. Yeah. I am asking you... If, why, why it stopped? Why did they stop sacrificing It, it was not for religious purpose. Oh, the sacrifice not the virgin was no, not for no, religious no, purpose. Even okay. the men, they were only sacrificed for offenses. Criminals, 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 criminals. Yeah. But the virgins were purely for herbal or charm or voodoo making. Yes. So you kill the you sacrifice the the criminals. Let me ask. So well, well the, I see it in the in Christianity that Jesus gets sacrificed as a criminal. Every one of them yes. uh, in so Old Testament. God gave him only son as a sacrifice. That's that's uh, uh, so well, what, what 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 I talk about now is this tradition <laughs> of the the sacrifice Abraham and his Isaac yeah him did sacrifice, sacrifice him son. and many that we are not reading yeah uh, you uh, definitely with your exposure and wide reading you have read the uh, the lost books of the Bible yes uh -huh. yes so and, and uh, uh, but we we not want to go the last books of the Bible we want to ask you something about Benin yeah. the Benin thing yeah. a while ago you know uh, there are two Benins. Yeah, the Benin, Benin country was founded by my Benin. You know that too. Yes. The soldiers yeah, from my town. Bendel State, Benin in Bendel State. Yes. Yeah, was it, founded uh, the 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 Benin country in West Africa. Yeah. But we we could go back to this mm. religious idea of sacrifice, because we go to Belize and we see them sacrifice. Mm. Them two women half of the them them half of the, the pyramids. Them. As I'm looking, it only Jamaica may not have made. Uh, 
Human sacrifice. No, we sacrifice humans every day, Anya. So we have the most sacrifice, Anya. So. Oh, I yeah, we know. use gun. So why is Benis on so we use gun in your mouth? No, because I uh, no no no. I am trying to uh, okay. no no no. We are there. Okay. Look here. I'm just trying to get a historical perspective. Okay, that's good. I want to know, you know. I don't okay. want to believe. I want to know. I am saying that we kill people every day, Anya. So do you know power? Yes. Is the source for human sacrifice. Yes. And that is number one. Because power... If you have authority over life, you, decide you can use it do, anything you want to do. That is, what, that is what big men do. Like Bush and Ben Laden and now we say Osama doing it. Now what we are saying... We could go back Let to me Benin. make a parable to you. Benin, we want to about Let me know. tell yes. you one thing. The when a child, the program I got done it If your child yes. sees your wife in bed, that's his mother or her mother, yes. with another man. Yes. If he doesn't tell you, the ancestors of your family will kill him or her. Yeah. If he tells you, the ancestors of the mother's family will kill him or her. Yes. So. I don't know. You a, king's, a king's uh, servant that does not stammer, they will cut his head off. Yes. So, yeah, we know that. Talk to me, Bini. Uh, religion, medicine, that one minus uh, politics or anything. No, no, it just, you see, when we talk about sacrifice, it's part of the religion because I thought, yes. I thought. Ogu is annoying. The God of iron is annoying. That is why he's pushing men and women to do what they are doing. So, yes. a time will come when we will realize that prayers alone will not help us. Well, prayers obviously is not helping us. Because you can't have a son on your foot and then raise it up and be say, I command you in the name yeah. of Ogubu, I will be healed. It will not heal. Definitely. Unless you go and pluck leaves from the roadside in Jamaica and then squeeze put and it put it on it. Of course. So, Fiat without well, works, the Christian can. man is intoxicated mm. and the whole world is in madness. Yeah. So, we are watching if, I do not believe in the end of life, yes. whether power will not Life be, cannot end. Life cannot end. Yeah. But the program can. Mm. This program can end. <laughs> and this is the end of the program. <laughs> now, when, when you say leave Jamaica, when you're leaving, when, you, when are you leaving Jamaica? Oh, I'm leaving on Saturday morning. I Saturday. will soon be back. So I will come to meet you so that you when? help me look for a concubine outside. I won't put her inside, so I will be coming always. Yeah, and then you can, sh uh, then you can give me a sneer that I can give a cock and make him crow. <laughs> <laughs> so here, here what now? When you come back to Jamaica, yeah. you come to visit me. Okay. Come to visit me. You spend some time with me. And then we got you all of this again. And okay. then you can show me some of the herbs and things. I will show you. Yes. And the I will, and only I will thing you. I will want you to see is the oracle of faith and fortune. Because... I want to share it with the Jamaicans. Yes. The day is going to be done. Yes. I will come with my full regalia. My full regalia is a whole luggage. Yeah, I know that. So I know that. Then you will arrange your max so that we set a table. Yes. I get into trance so that I don't fall any of them. Yes. Then people will be phoning in. Yeah. I will say you that yeah, phone me. We never me take no phone call. It's not pretty, but that's how it go. We never take no phone call. But the okay. conversation was lively. Okay. We give thanks mm -hmm. for you to extend this invitation. No problem. To come here in this hours of the morning for me really mm. vex you so and annoy you this week. <laughs> but this is the cutting edge. You're not going to go on no other program that behave like this. Thank we, you. Yes. And as we say, if you come again, the invitation is open to come for the program, mm. and I would love to see you get in that trance. You know, if, if I did have a next half hour, I'd love to see the trance. I'll mash up, the, 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 make, make the page mash up. But I will, t I will definitely, I got, I got six pages. Meanwhile, I was playing the, the tape. I reached about six pages out of this book. Yeah. So I will be reading these books, and then I will really see... I understand it still, you know. I understand it. You know? yeah. It's just that I think we, just like what you said, the evolution of sacrifice, mm -hmm. I think Africans need to evolve out of certain things, yeah. you know, because those things is what 
help us to be in the darkness mm -hmm. that we find ourselves in in the west here because trust me black people serious darkness in the western world here serious yeah. mm -hmm. so we say give thanks to the moment give thanks to the sister for coming with you give thanks to the bridging for drive you yeah and it's just so it's just so so matrix at two o'clock you know so we're done exactly two o'clock here so you can't tell somebody that well my people we have made it to the end give thanks to the ones and ones who made it this far powerful reasoning by both men yeah man really eye opening and uh, you know i learned so much very educational you know it's a black power movement definitely drop a like and subscribe share to a friend or a family so they can be a part of the movement and my people catch you in the next one Irie.